Hello everyone, welcome back to another video at Topaz Detailing. I'm Thomas, the social media manager here in London. We've got some very, very cool cars to show you here today. Beautiful 296 GTB in the wash bay, just getting prepared. But next to me, you can't miss this. This is incredible. We've done a video on one of these before, but we had to show you this again. We actually put this on our Instagram page and it went viral. I think it got nearly 3 million views when we put this on Instagram. So we thought we've got to get this in a video on YouTube as well. Of course, it's the Aston Martin Valkyrie. We've got it in for a very, very good customer of ours. We're going to be doing our bespoke paint protection film package on this car. We're also going to give you an, another workshop tour because you really enjoyed the one in the last video. We've got some more amazing cars in the workshop, a little bit of behind the scenes because you guys seem to like that. Talking of behind the scenes, we've had to cover that car up behind the Valkyrie because it is secret. You might be able to tell what it is from the shape, but I can't tell you any more about it. But that's enough from me for now. I'm going to head elsewhere into the workshop and show you everything that's going on. promise you some very very special cars in the workshop for a little bit of a behind the scenes look around right here this is absolutely stunning 812 competizione super limited ferrari the latest and greatest from marinello but something a little bit different about this one you'll notice we're doing our satin conversion on this car so you can see this is the original finish here the gloss viola hong kong paintwork however our stealth paint protection film has already gone on these sections to transform this car to a unique satin Ferrari call it a Paco finish really special look however we're not stopping there there's an amazing contrast on this car the carbon fiber of course is staying in gloss but even better than that this is something you cannot get from Ferrari completely unique to a car that's been at Topaz we're leaving the stripe in gloss as well so this will go in our gloss paint protection films all patterned from scratch completely unique design on this car satin and gloss it's going to look really really nice when it's finished and we don't stop there either another special feature on the car are super super expensive carbon fiber alloy wheels and we protect those as well with our ppf so this car is going to be completely protected no need to worry about scratches stone chips scuffs anything like that and it's going to look stunning when it's done as well moving further along two completely different but also special cars special because they're a matching pair here we've got the outlander Defender, this is a bit of a resto mod, really cool specification, having full bespoke paint protection film coverage, because obviously we've not necessarily worked on a car, especially these hand-built cars, anything like this one before. So we have to pattern it all from scratch, really cool spec as well. Got the metallic green with the tan interior, the interior is sensational, we'll overlay some shots of it as well. And then just quite nice to have next to it, the new Defender as well, old school and new school Defenders parked side by side, both of them of course benefiting from our PPF. Now we're going to cut into some shots of the Valkyrie getting worked on because I know you'll all be excited to see that. Then after that, I'm going to take you upstairs and show you what special cars we have hiding up there as well. I promise you some nice cars upstairs. It's always a little bit of an Aladdin's cave up here. A few things that I can show you today. We've got this really, really nice F12 Berlinetta. These I really think are turned into a modern classic. And this one, 
even more so. If you notice, it's fully monochrome. We've got no Scuderia shields on the side, which is quite rare. No yellow calipers, even carbon center caps, all matching, everything great. I really like that, it's a nice touch. Then next to us, we've got a 911 Sport Classic, the new 992. This is green with a full tan interior for a very, very good customer of ours. I absolutely adore this spec. We'll make sure to put some B-roll up of the interior of this car because it's stunning. Then over here, about to have our level two detail. 991 Turbo S Cabriolet, really nice colour. Looking a little bit dull at the moment, but once Bogdan, our detailer, is finished with the car, it's, that colour is going to pop. You're going to love it. So I can't wait to see the finished result. Then also, we've got the Rolls-Royce Dawn and the Ferrari 812 GTS up here as well, just getting prepared for handover to the customer. But that's enough from me. We're going to go back into the workshop and show you what else is going on. Now in the main PPF area of the workshop again. Behind me, some really, really nice cars. The colour on this Lamborghini Huracan is something else. This is actually a satin paint from the factory in this amazing satin purple, which means we have to use our stealth PPF to protect the paint, because if you scratch a car like this, you cannot polish it out, and also to preserve that satin finish, because you cannot use gloss film on a satin paint, which some of you might not realise. Then next to it, we've got the epic Aston Martin Valkyrie. This thing's caused a little bit of a stir when we posted it up on our Instagram and you'll already seen in the video this car having paint protection film fitted to it. Just to see it in the workshop, we see a lot of special cars at Topaz. We've even seen the race car version of the Valkyrie in here before, the AMR Pro. But whenever we have one in, this thing is an absolute head turn. You can't help but stand and stare at it, especially in a really, really nice spec like this. Moving further along, we've got more Lamborghini Urus, Aston Martin DBX, also both in a satin paint, so having our stealth paint protection will fit into them. Then in the corner, something I do want to show you. Here's a little clue. So this is a carbon fiber piece, which is being protected, why we've got it on this trestle table, taking it off the car to protect it. Some of you might be able to tell what this is, but if you can't, I'm gonna tell you now that it came off this car, and this is the Ferrari 812 Competizione Aperta. This is one of the very, very first in the country. It's in this amazing colour scheme, we'll show you some more shots overlaid, of green, Verde Zeltweg with the tan interior. Absolutely beautiful. One of the first in the country, and of course it's at Topaz, to be fully protected, which we'll show you lots and lots of shots of in a moment.
So a little bit of an update from elsewhere in the workshop. Here in our ice blasting bay, we're doing our ice blasting treatment on this epic Porsche 993 Turbo. We love to work on the classic cars and see a real transformation when it comes to the underbody of these amazing cars and the ice blaster. You can see all of these metallic pieces. We're gonna overlay some clips of how it looked before. This car was in a state. But thanks to our ice blasting treatment, which uses high velocity, high pressure, very, very cold CO2 pellets, aimed at all of these metallic pieces. This car, it's not quite finished yet, but we will show you when it is finished. This car is gonna come out like brand new underneath, which of course we'll be detailing the car on top as well and giving it our paint protection film. So when we're finished, this car is gonna be amazing. So the car is now finished, the Aston Martin Valkyrie. You can see it next to me, looking incredible under our workshop lights. I promise you a little bit of a treat. We've got John Luca, one of our detailers, already sitting in the car, waiting to start it up. I have to warn you, once the car starts, you will not be able to hear me or him. So the video is pretty much gonna end then. After this, we're gonna load the car up, but that's the end of the video. So we're gonna talk you through, this is pretty unique, something you won't have seen in many other places. This is how to start up the Aston Martin Valkyrie hypercar. So let's go say hello to John Luca. So, hi guys, uh, this steering wheel, it does have a quick release, so it's helping you to get in and out of the car. Uh, it's a quite easy and straightforward uh, procedure. Uh, so, of course, we need to plug in the steering wheel. So now the steering wheel is plugged in. Obviously, the car is keyless. As you can see, it's a nice and tidy key. We need to get the, uh, press the start, start button once and then we need to wait a few moments uh, because the car need to uh, like reset and being prepared to to the starting uh, process as you can see the display came alive we always need to make sure the battery is fully charged if it's going under the tree line can be a problem because this car needs a lot of uh, electric power to, to start the engine because of course it's a V12. So now we have both mirrors on, the central dis uh, display on, and we wait the exact time that we need to wait. So now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna start the car. From now on, you probably will not be able to hear me. Um, so yeah, enjoy the sound.